Hey, how's it going? You ever have these technology gigs, snafus, glitches, whatever? I sometimes have them and I'm going through one today as I buy this external hard drive. And the problem is you get these iCloud Drive and Google Drive and Dropbox. And you have all this crap up there and you start to get full. So I want to get it off of there so that my other stuff will work correctly. Put it on an external drive and then have it there and delete it off everything else. And while I'm talking about this, I bet you you could have a support group for this. Is there anybody else out there that just does not want to save every freaking photo that they've ever taken in their life or every video or every moment of every day has to be chronicled somehow electronically it never goes away you can't you just throw things away it's it's nuts that's been my biggest hassle with technology i'd say over the past few years is just trying to get rid of stuff you would figure a 250 gig computer has enough room for everything you ever want to do even with all the high-speed stuff going online and everything it should be plenty of storage but it's not because it never ever gets anything away for instance here's this is crazy go on my iCloud drive and it says I have 130 gigs of documents so I look in the documents folder and it's empty and I'm looking all over the place and I cannot find documents so how do I have 130 gigs of stuff? I don't even know what it is. I don't know where it is. I can't find it. I would like to delete all of it, but then you start wondering, crap, what if it's critical? What if I have to have it for something? I, it just drives me nuts, this stuff. So <laughs> I don't see how this is, this is just a talking about what hassles I'm having with my technology particularly storage and wondering how many people am I the only one <laughs> that has this going on it's crazy now in your marketing you want to save all of your videos all of your writing everything that you do and you have to have it organized someplace that you own and that's why I like the external drives because shoot you could take that drive and put it in a safe deposit box if you wanted to and you'd never lose any of your stuff which is helpful for instance if you're putting videos up on YouTube and you get your account shut down I've seen this happen to very reputable people and I don't know what I get just someone complains or something and there they go with five years of videos with millions of views completely wiped out. And that's why you can't build your business on free platforms like that because they can wipe you out at a whim. So if you got all your stuff saved somewhere, especially if it's not connected to the internet and it's all packed away somewhere, even if you did get shut down, you could re-upload it. But the point being, you honestly, as a business, want to own the places where your critical content is. Because if you ever get wiped out, you're done for. So that's why I spend the time to find out about putting stuff on external drives and not everything all up in the cloud. Because it's really something you don't own. And... I know a lot of people like to say if you're paying for your hosting they can't shut you down it's not true they will shut you down and I'm not saying you got to run your own host but when it comes down to your content find a way to secure that it's not on one of these clouds the rest of the time you can use it on the cloud but you got to have something backing it up imagine you build yourself up to hundreds of thousands of dollars a year and all of a sudden all your stuff's gone something to think about Anyway, that's all I got from the land of struggling with the external drive. I'll talk to you tomorrow. I'm out.